2E0XVX with a video on the All Star Micronode made by Peter G7 RPG. So, this is the little box. It's got a LED on the front, which is a multi coloured one uh, green, red, and blue. If we spin the box around, you can see it has a sticker on the back and it's got my Micronode details my Micronode number, the frequency and the CCS7 tone code which he normally sets at 77 Hz it's got a power in socket uh, anything from 0 to I think it's 30 something volts don't quote me on that one and a power switch that's all there is little box so what we need to do is program a radio to set frequency on the back of the box I've already got mine done so it's like Blue Peter I've got mine programmed in you can see it on the screen there, Micronode 2, which is the frequency on this one. So, what I shall do is just put this down, or I plug this in. Okay, so what we have to do now is sit and listen. So, we have the radio turned up, and we keep an eye on this LED light. This is the important bit. So, we need to wait. Great little box box is about £130, uh, it's a really good bit of kit, probably one of the best bits of kit you're going to buy for your shack. All Star is a lot better than uh, Echo Link for audio quality, right this is going to start doing, there we go. One, nine, two, dot, one, six, eight, dot, one, dot, one, three, six. Okay, that's now just given out the IP address, very important, so it ended in 136. So now we'll go to the computer and I will show you. Good afternoon. The time is <laughs> okay. 5.14pm. Okay, you get all these idents on All Star, which you don't hear on Echo Link. You get uh, time idents, you get your Morse code uh, transmitted of the, of the box, so when people don't hear on that on echo link so these are the sort of things you do here on all star so what we'll do is we'll now uh, pause this and go over to the second part of the video 2e0x3x with part two of the all star system right i've gone over to the computer and i now need to open up a window i tend to use um google for this sort of thing because it seems to be a lot better so we need to type in up here in the uh, banner bar up there we need to type the IP address, so it was 192.168.1.136 and you will now see a window which Peter has made up obviously mine is the Micronode 44277 control screen and on here he's got some added in uh, quick links now you can add in more if you want so, for argument's sake, we will go to the hubnet, which is 41522. So, um, if I just program my radio up and I click on there, you will hear it. Okay, these are all the people that are connected to the hubnet. Uh, you can actually go to a graphical bubble if it will allow me. It seems to be working. Oh, this is. There we go. This is a, uh, a bubble map of all the people connected. The main two servers, the All Star servers, me there in blue connected to the server, and then all around are all the people connected into the UK hubnet. Now you can go to the Win and the WAN system, places that you cannot go with Echolink. They will not let you into those systems. So All Star gains you access to two big American networks, really big. We'll just take you over to the Win system. So this is going to disconnect and then reconnect to the Win system. not being connected long enough 
Um, it normally takes a couple of minutes for it to uh, populate on the All Star server before you go. Anyway, that's the main uh, rundown of the All Star node. Hope that's of uh, use to you there, Derek.